Today, there are over 60 different mobs in the world of Minecraft. And while some mobs boast some decent signs of wits and initiative, others, well, not so much. In this video, we count down the top five mobs that don't really offer intelligence as one of their best traits. Keep in mind, these listed mobs are all critiqued during their respective state of when this video was recorded and may receive improvements in the future. And for their sake, I kinda hope so. So after thoroughly testing and researching each candidate separately, we have our list. Minecraft has no shortage of simple mobs. Not that there's anything wrong with that, as they say ignorance is bliss. But when observing one of these smaller mobs, known as endermites, most are left scratching their heads. Endermites are as simple as a hostile mob can get. They boast no quirks at all to aid them in any situation and can be escaped from simply by walking. Their ineptability to recognize danger is quite the circus act. Even a mindless mob known to have no brains has an easier time thinking things through. Despite having a very tight list on our hands this episode, we find our next guest on the show living in the ocean. Squids. I would say don't be fooled by their looks, but they ain't fooling nobody looking like that. A single glimpse at them and you can tell they're missing a few chromosomes. But when we dive deeper into a squid's behavior, well, there's just not much to observe. Their best and only display of smarts is seen when hurting one of these poor dudes as they disperse a cloud of black ink and swim in the opposite direction, acting much like a mid-panic smoke bomb. But the wonderful irony about this is, in real life, squid are rather intelligent and are actually believed to be the most intelligent invertebrates in existence. I bet they feel real ashamed of how they're represented in Minecraft. We've all heard them. We've all seen them. And yet, not much explanation is needed. Cause there's just not much to explain. Like most farm animals in Minecraft, cows really struggle to do much at all. Their blood brother mushrooms also suffer from the poor genetics, sharing the number three spot. Their wits extend to knowing how to follow someone with food and know how to get funky. But beyond that amazing arsenal of knowledge, cows are the only animal that fails to recognize it's in water and will make zero attempt to exit a body of water with the pure purpose in mind to get out of the body of water. Look, there are some poor mobs in Minecraft that suffer from barely any coditis, but there's nothing quite like the cow. And please excuse me for a moment, but am I the only one that hears this? No. No. It's almost convenient, right? It's like they're crying out for help, Mojang. Deep amongst the darkness within caves, every now and then, we may run into a flappy boy, or more commonly referred to as bats. All that can be learned from their behavior is almost not worth mentioning. They sleep, they flap, and then they sleep some more. Attack them, and they flap more, but can't decide on a direction to retreat, failing to grasp the technique of fleeing. When lava is local, more than often bats by themselves find themselves killing themselves one after another. Can't say that for many mobs in Minecraft. It's fair enough to say simple mobs deserve simple features, but when you're this simple, excuses don't run very far. Among other poor pathfinding skills, lacking the simple aptitude to identify dark areas from light in which they will eventually despawn, 
the only tiny display of initiative is they try to fly away from us if we get too close. Sometimes. Yeah, look, I'm struggling here. The word basic doesn't even do bats justice, but it gets worse, a lot worse. To think all life on Earth begun in the ocean, our earliest ancestors swimming around, evolving over millions of years, slowly developing bigger, better, and more efficient brains. All I can say is God bless evolution. Ladies and gentlemen, I present you the fish. Short, long, longer, it doesn't help them. Fish in Minecraft embarrass me more than my jokes do, but these little guys are no joke. They are the real dumb deal. Unlike bats, fish actually have the potential to show signs of small smarts. I'd like to talk about their attempt to create distance from nearby swimming players, or their attempt to flee after being attacked, their attempt to flop themselves towards bodies of water, or their attempt to recognize other fish of their type, but take my word for it, I'd be wasting your time. While other chromosome questioning mobs in Minecraft may at least display one or two minor signs of a developing brain, cod, salmon, tropical, it's a complete failure across the entire board as they get a nice fat red F on every test given. Pufferfish, due to a couple impressive little defensive features, do indeed escape the number one spot safe and sound. But when speaking about the intellect of these poor fellas, one simply doesn't speak at all. Good friends of the internet, this is the part of the video where I drop to my knees and pretty much beg for your support. So if you enjoyed your brief time with me here, like giving the like video a like would like be awesome. Like. But seriously, any support at all is much appreciated, and I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Until then, goodbye!